How many a times we've made promises to people or we have contracts with people? We've agreed on something and then we back off. You know how bad it is to back off on a contract? It's like a marriage. You know why marriage is so important? It's a contract. I don't care if your wife is not good or your husband's not good. It's a contract and you respect it. When you marry a person, male or female, that woman who's giving herself to you and that man who's giving himself to her, it's a contract. Sure, it's not rosy. No marriage dares to be rosy. I remember when I got married, the first thing I said, even in my marriage night, I said, I do not believe my marriage has a golden path. It's my spouse and I that will build the golden path together through trials and tribulations. Otherwise, there is no golden path. Don't fool yourselves of thinking of some rosy idea of a prince kissing a princess and they lived happily ever after. It's fictitious. It's not true. It doesn't exist. So we have problems. Who doesn't have problems? Unless you are super pious on both sides, you minimize those problems. But it's a contract. And there's a beauty to the contract. Then once you stick with it, you stick with it till death unless you have to break it, it's not working. This is where divorce comes into play. Otherwise, you live with it thick and thin. It's a contract, just like a business. It's a contract. The admiration of a couple is when they both adhere to the contract. Believe me, Allah has built a system that if husband and wife from two parts of the world, if they adhere to the contract of Allah and they put Allah as their sign, وَمِنْ آيَاتِي أَنْ خَلَقَ لَكُمْ مِنْ أَنفُسِكُمْ أَزْوَاجًا لِتَسْكُنُوا إِلَيْهَا وَجَعَلَ بَيْنَكُمْ مَوَدَّةً وَرَحْمًا إِنَّ فِي ذَلِكَ لَآيَاتٍ لِقَوْمِ يَتَفَكَّرُونَ Of his signs is he made mates from yourselves. It's a contract. If you don't keep this contract, and you violate where you leave your wife behind, and you seek another woman out there, you're violating a contract. So no, no, it's my right. I can marry another. No, it's not our right, brothers. I specifically say to the brothers, it is not our right. This is wrong. You think our women are objects? No, they're passionate and compassionate. And sisters too, who are married, who are busy talking to other men. Haram. It's a contract, brothers and sisters. And don't think it's a limitation. It's where growth takes place. Believe me, any other way is a limitation. Contract, hold on to it. And argue with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and say, Oh Allah, please, Rabbana hablana min azwajina wa dhurriyatina qurrata a'yun waj'alna lil muttaqina imama. Put love between us and make them beautiful to our eyes and our children too. Hmm? And make us leaders among the pious. This is a great dua to read. If the husband and wife read it, impossible for the two to fight. Impossible. Because they're parallel lines now. Because they're both going towards Allah. And they will understand. See? Ruhamao bayinahum. They are merciful with each other.